Such chill music. Mm. <laughs> so good. No wonder Lady An chose this place. Of course it's good. This is a famous hotel after all. Oh yeah. I heard that the police are coming to interview some people at school. That's troublesome. Our names are gonna come up for sure. People are spreading all sorts of rumors about us and Kamoshida. But we got him pumped up. I keep hearing stuff like the Phantom Thieves really stole his heart. I think most people don't believe it, but some of them actually seem grateful. Look at this. The Phantom Aficionado website? Well done, Phantom Thieves. Now I can keep going too. Thank you for giving us hope. Pretty cool, huh? I was just desperate to deal with my own problems, but seeing people saying all this feels strange. Yeah. Hey, what do we do now? Huh? Oh, crap, you're totally right. We only got an hour to eat. Just 50 minutes left. <laughs> I'm not gonna finish all the beef dishes at this pace. <laughs> I need to eat my way through the entire dessert menu. Look after our stuff. We'll snag some for you guys too. Don't worry. Oh man, God melts in my mouth. <laughs> Seriously, only meat? He gonna go food coma. Get meat sweats. Where should I start? And she's all about the cake. So happy. <laughs> hey, calories. <laughs> Shut up. How much do you think one of these costs? I'll never get the chance to do this again. Mm, the Wilton Hotel Cake Buffet. I'd heard rumors, but I never thought it'd be so amazing. <laughs> and where's our share? I didn't really know what you'd want. So I just grabbed you some beans. <laughs> beans? There were some pretty bizarre things there, too. So we got you a variety of those. Fried bananas, preserved eggs, and some kind of beans. M more beans? <laughs> beans! You put so much on the plate that it got all mixed up. But it should probably still taste good. This is just plain grotesque. Let's go. These two just don't know what fine dining means. We'll show them. Don't worry about the details. You guys watch our things while we're gone. Wait patiently for our return. Mm. Oh, it's like a meaty explosion in my mouth. Give me a second, guys. I'm gonna have to screen cap that. Where's my screen cap tool? And done. Oh, this part's cream cheese. They're not even listening. All right, Yuri, I will check it out next time I get on my switch.
Table with fish. With fish. Hooligan free. Okay, what's it getting now? All right, I think there's just the desserts over here. He's got his toy. Thank you. 
Yeah, I did. She's got all full on cake. Damn it. We're going to kill ourselves on this food. <laughs> Another dish. Totally panicked when I saw the closed for cleaning sign at the bathrooms. <laughs> you were talking big about eating until you puke, but you really did puke. Are you some kind of moron? Hey, same goes for you. What floor was that restaurant on? We came up to get here, so it has to be on a lower floor, right? There's still no update on the case. Uh, not yet. Hey, excuse me, but why are you so involved? It's not something you should be concerned with. I don't care about your opinion, you incompetent buffoon. When I say pick up the pace, you do it. Hey, you're cutting in line. What do you want? What do you want? We're in a hurry. Oh, I'm sorry. So you can butt in front of other people if you're in a hurry? It seems the customer base has changed since I was here last. Have they started a daycare? What? Sir, we don't have time for this. I know. Don't bother with them. They're getting pushy. Oh, is that? What the hell was with that bossy guy? Shouldn't we head back down? That might have been the one that we punched to get in trouble yeah, originally. But down on everyone don't lose your temper over this I 
just can't forgive shitty adults like that. <laughs> What's wrong? That's just gonna make me worry more, you know. I bet it's because he rarely eats well. I'm always stuck with canned cat food, too. Yeah, that sir bullshit makes me sick. Damn it! What took you so long? Why are you all pissy? Sorry. I had a run-in with some woman a second ago. She bumped into me, but then said it was all my fault when she dropped her plate. You wouldn't get more food? Sounds like a real bitch. Yeah. Thanks, though. But the restaurant workers all looked at me with this disapproving expression. I wonder if we're out of place here. Morgana. What is it? Anyone could have a palace, yeah? Anyone with a strong, distorted desire. Same for them having a change of heart if their treasure gets stolen? That would be the case. Why are you bringing this up all of a sudden? We had trouble earlier, too. These selfish shitheads who just look down on everyone else. I was just wondering if we'd be able to change those kinds of people, too. You mean, you want to continue as the Phantom Thieves? I've been thinking. He doesn't do that very often. We put a lot of work into changing Kamoshida's heart, but nobody believes in the Phantom Thieves. Plus, those guys who had no other choice but to just deal with it are thanking us. Us, of all people! I... I agree. If we ignore people who are in trouble, I'd go back to being the same as I was before. Well, that's true. You're under my tutelage. There's nothing we can't accomplish as Phantom Thieves. Shouldn't we be able to help him out? But that means we'll have to fight shadows again, doesn't it? Indeed, that can't be avoided. Eh, I'm sure we'll manage. <laughs> right? Even if you guys are still just fledglings, this means we're an actual organization now. Fledglings? <laughs> That's actually pretty fitting for us. All right, it's settled. We're gonna catch all these shitty adults by surprise and make ourselves known to the world. Are you okay being our leader? No objections here? I can't handle all that responsibility stuff. Where's my say in this? But Lady Ahn made the recommendation, so I'll allow it. Well, should we decide on a name for our group? I just went with Phantom Thieves of Hearts last time, but don't you think a real name would be cooler? Ooh, I got it. I want it to be something both cute and luxurious sounding. Let me see. <gasps> How about the diamonds? <laughs> Getting the real Little League Baseball feel from it. Well then, here's my suggestion. How about Tilefish Poilet? What? 
That was terrible. Tile, uh, what? That's what I ate earlier. It's commemorative, no? Oh no, you idiot! Uh, you decide for us. Yeah, we gotta go with Waifu Warrior. And I just realized I never muted with the dog barking. Sorry, guys. He is mad. our next target there are tons of rotten adults and all why not just stick to targeting big names yeah something along those lines if we go after some big wig it's got to get on the news right don't you think more people would believe in us if we did that that's not a bad idea. For you, Ryuji. True. If we become better known, we might be able to give courage to a lot more people. I don't really like the idea of just picking someone out of the blue, though. Let's narrow it down to someone we can all agree on then. Hmm. So we need a big wig we decide on unanimously. I like that unanimous decision part. It's like we're making some kind of pact. Now then, this is the official formation of the Phantom Thieves organization. Oh no! Our time for the buffet ran out. I guess we'll just have to talk more tomorrow. Oh no. Time speeding up again. We're going to hit 7-7 seven, seven and Atlas is going to strike us. Another world in which people's distorted cognitions take shape? Stealing treasure to change hearts? And on top of that, a talking cat told you all this. Honestly speaking, that all sounds absurd. It's hard to believe that this is even worth listening to. Still, it can't be considered nonsense when parts of it align with Kamoshida's confession. The same goes for the testimonies of the officers who arrested you. But so be it. At any rate, you mentioned something more important. These two other accomplices, besides this talking cat thing that appeared in your story. From what you've been telling me, they're students at the same school, aren't they? Very well. 
I'll leave it at that. Let's continue on. There are many more events that I must inquire on. Lies and false accounts are eventually exposed. The next to receive a calling card was this individual. I need to spoil it all out for you there. A master of Japanese arts, Ichiryusai Madarame. It's even more incomprehensible than Kamoshida as to why this man was targeted. Where did you come to know him? And how did you learn of his crimes when you weren't a victim of them? Start by telling me what you all schemed. Okay. Okay, let's try. I swear you don't let me do I'll anything. Well then. Alright, let's go the next day. I don't know what we got. Igor. First off, I'd like to begin by congratulating you. To think our master would give words of praise. You better treasure this moment, inmate. You have encountered allies who share your aesthetics. And you have found your place in reality. The time has come. Your rehabilitation will soon begin. I shall explain it to you now. You have a special potential. However, that must be refined into a useful power. It is weak now, but refining it shall grant you the strength to stand against the coming ruin. That is the rehabilitation cast upon you. It's time you learn something for once. There are various means by which you may gain the power to resist the ruin. Fighting shadows and gaining experience is one way. The fusion process I taught you prior is another. This is all possible because of our master's guidance, inmate. Though it may be presumptuous of us, we have words of wisdom as well. When you're out in reality, you better hone your relationships with those you have contracts with. Spending time with those people will lead to the cultivation of your relationships with them. If you've got time to waste, you'd better visit your contractors, inmate. That is another source of power to evade the ruin that our master has mentioned. Thanks to the contracts you formed, your heart is steadily gaining the power of opposition. It seems the rehabilitation is going well. This is a truly joyous occasion. I shall grant you an ability befitting of your newfound growth. Consider it a gift. 
May the devotion to your rehabilitation grow even deeper. I have high hopes of you. Look at that. Ooh, up to eight persona slots. All right. The time has come. Return to your brief moments of rest. And don't forget to go talk to your contractor's inmate. I love that you got the little bar down there in the corner. So you can see how you're doing. Have you heard? But it's only at night, so I can't do it. Okay, quiet down. She is like the worst teacher. <sighs> She's talking about personas. much but we've been getting more postings on the phantom aficionado website i want to make my friend apologize for not returning the stuff i lent him <sighs> do with that yourself hey those girls you know that phantom thieves rumor about stealing kamashita's heart i wonder if it's true it's gotta be made up do you seriously believe they exist Look what happened to Kamashita. He probably just couldn't keep hiding it after that girl tried to kill herself. Yeah, you might be right. I guess there's no way they really exist. Most importantly, it seriously sucks that our school is going to be known for stuff like this. I wonder if it'll affect our college entrance. That's probably a normal reaction for now, but they'll see soon enough. If we can take care of two or three famous guys, people will have to believe we exist. So about those big shots, we don't have any leads yet, right? Plus, there's that rumor about you two threatening Kamoshida, too. Looks like you'll just have to live a normal, honest school life for the time being. 
Still, make sure you stay prepared just in case anything comes up, all right? I'll keep an eye out for info on any big shots that might be coming around. And I'll try to dig up some dirt online. We went and formed the Phantom Thieves group, but we can't even find a target. There, there. I guess sometimes things just don't go the way we want them to. Excuse me. Did you wish to see me, Principal Kobayakawa? You saw the state Kamashita-kun was in, didn't you? It's as if his personality has completely changed. Something is definitely wrong here. I'm not sure I follow. From what I've heard, it appears as though some students were meddling in his business. If they did something to him, who could they be? Are you saying that these students may have caused Mr. Kamashita to change? That is what I wish to know, even if it takes some probing into student matters. I would like you to look into this for me. It is true that there are many rumors regarding Mr. Kamashita, but... Do you mean all of this talk about those phantom thieves? It is undeniable that Mr. Kamoshida has changed in some way. I'd like to have a grasp of the cause. This shall also ensure that I handle the mass media and police in the correct fashion. Oh. I will continue speaking to Mr. Kamoshida myself. Unless you find whomever did this, these irresponsible rumors will likely never die down. Don't you agree? You have been at the top of your class since day one. Your conduct is good, and teachers favor you. I could write you a recommendation for any college of your choosing, Makoto Nijima. Thank you. Your lineage must certainly play a part in this excellence. Your sister is still young, yet she holds an admirable position at the public prosecutor's office, no? If something disappointing were to happen here, that wouldn't reflect very well on your sister. Do you understand? Yes. <laughs> How wise. It's no wonder you're our student council president. I'd appreciate if you'd look into this as soon as possible. I ask that you begin at once. Yes, if you'll excuse me then. It's me, sir. My apologies for troubling you at such a busy time. Yes, it's about the matter we discussed earlier. I have all bases covered. The investigation will begin immediately. Mm -hmm, of course. Yes, I will get results. I should be able to update you soon. Well then, I must be going. Thank you very much for your time. All right, let's hope if we can... Hey, have you seen that Phantom Aficionado website? I'm the one 
who started it. Well, that was easy. <laughs> um, you guys are the Phantom Thieves, aren't you? Sorry. Although, if things really are as I think, I should keep it a secret. Kamoshida used me, and I did some horrible things to you guys. This isn't much of a way for me to apologize for it. But if there's anything I can do to help, just let me know. That's all I needed to say. There are many more evil adults outside of Kamoshida. But I'm sure the Phantom Thieves will do something. They can't let this end after just one target. That's why I wanted to make a forum where people could post their problems. There are probably a lot of people who have high hopes for the Phantom Thieves' next move. So, I've also implemented an anonymous poll on the site. Do you believe in the Phantom Thieves or not? I hope someday my forum is filled with supportful posts. I'd really like to help out in the Phantom Thieves' acts of justice. Can I, please? I'll live up to your expectations. I promise. Back to the future. Besides the public's reaction to your group, there were others who supported you. Someone who enthusiastically cheered the Phantom Thieves on. Perhaps they were quite close. What do you have to say to that? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Moon Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Oh, nice. All right. That'll be good once we get new, new uh, party members. In something Persona games haven't really had before. Tokyo Mirage Systems had it, which was nice. We heard all that. Jeez. It was a little awkward trying to figure out when to walk over here. So that forum is Mishima Kun's. Has he figured out our identities? Even so, I think it'll be fine. You seem to be playing it cool. I guess we should have a little chat about this later. I will say, though, a forum where people can post problems may prove unexpectedly useful. Anyways, we gotta get looking for a new target. And we need to stay sharp until we manage to find one. Once we do, we'll have to head into another palace. So we should prep our equipment and... Wait! Oh, crap! What's with you? Don't we have an exam coming up? <laughs> Judging by that reaction, I'd assume you're going to struggle this time, too. It's not like you're any better. All you're good at is English. I'd rather that than be bad at every subject. Even your Japanese is questionable at best, Ryuji. What's questionable is whether you're really even a human. <laughs> Good comeback, huh? Let's discuss this with our fists. <laughs> Bring it. Will you two stop it? They do fight like Yosuke and Teddy did all the time. Okay. Hmm. 
Okay. Okay, let's come back and do Anne, because we haven't done anything with her. But first things first. Let's go return our DVD and pick up a new one. Decency, kindness, charming. We haven't done anything charming yet. Check bookstore. Please take your time. Check the video game place real quick. Oh, nothing here. Just want to make sure we don't miss like a confidant or something. Return back to that shop or go to Ann. Back to the classroom. See where we can go inside the school. Classroom, classroom, let me see exit. Cafeteria. Office. Hmm. It's was office. Faculty. Faculty. Student guidance. Hmm. Okay. 
is one room to check on the other side. Faculty. Okay, what do we got here? Calligraphy. Storage. Storage. Study hall. Computer. Music. Looks like a library over there. Just had to wander around and I found it eventually. Never on the third floor. Student Council. Where's that other one? See if we get anything out of this. Hey. That's incredible. <laughs> get some guts. Bold, sweet. Means we probably can do the next uh, uh, doctor. All right. Nice. Social link. And there's our knowledge. Still not there. All right. Want to head back? Hey. Hmm. Hmm. And 
it's to Shibuya. Still need more guts. Do you have okay. any weapons? Sounds good. No. Okay. Then I mean, you probably don't have anything. Come again. See if that guy's speaking over here. Please consider what I have to say. Let's go see about working there then. Go pick up the job offer. And then now that we can go out at night, we can actually work there. Let's go to Central Street. Okay, beef bowl. It's gotta be that one right there. I've been expecting you. on you just a manager and one employee <laughs> Hmm. 
It's more proficiency. Nice. Ranked up. All right. Let's head back. Rank up. I wonder how long till we open up our next palace. Yep, yep. Open your textbooks. Elizabeth. <laughs> exactly. Up. So rank up would be great. Nope. All right. Hmm. If it's anything like Persona 4, basically our next dungeon will be after the next exam. These posts are any good. Everyone's just bitching about their parents or their boyfriends. There ain't even a hint of a hint about a new palace. We can't get everything online. Finding a post with a name and location is asking a lot. Guess we just gotta find one ourselves then. Are you seriously suggesting we look for a target that even the police have overlooked? Yeah, you're right. We should probably just hold off till exams are done with, huh? We can wait and see for a little longer, then worry about coming up empty-handed if it happens. Oh. This place is off limits, you know. <sighs> we'll get out of here once we're done chatting. Anyways, what's Miss Council President want with us? Troublemaker, the girl of rumor, and the infamous transfer student. In <laughs> Great way to start a conversation. By the way, it seems as though you got to know Mr. Kamoshida pretty well. Yeah, you know, he's only been here a month or so. Hmm. I heard Mr. Kamoshida used a volleyball team member to spread details of your past record. Don't you hate him? Mr. Kamoshida, I mean. What's all this about? My friend here's an upstanding guy. I don't mean to offend. Many students have been shaken up by what happened with Mr. Kamoshida. The rumors about that odd calling card-esque posting aren't going away either. 
I didn't expect someone like you would care about that tactless stuff, Nijima Senpai. I don't know that it was tactless. Anyways, we done here? We can't leave if you keep talking to us. At least try to understand my position. Being forced to deal with this horseplay. Horseplay? Ah, oh, yes, by the way. It's been decided that this place will be closed off due to the incident. I heard some people are coming up here without permission, after all. I'm sorry to have interrupted you. What was that about? She's on to us. That girl seems rather sharp. We should be cautious of her. She really pisses me off. Pain in the ass. That reminds me. Study hard. Especially you, Ryuji. There are bound to be traps that will need to be solved with brains. Keep in mind that everything you do in your daily lives has an impact on your abilities. True. Studying won't be so bad if we just think of it as helping us prepare to be phantom thieves. I guess you got a point. Man, it's just so late. I was all fired up about helping people, not about studying. Well, I do have somewhere interesting to show you beforehand. You guys did originally promise to help me out with my mission, after all. Huh? Mission? Follow me. <laughs> 